I'm here to remind you that from Saturday, December 24th, Pink 60 will be bringing you some festive programmes looking back at the queer highlights of 2011. With guest presenters reminding us of what went on in the worlds of gay sport, cinema, politics and much more. So don't miss out. Pink 60 brings you the queer news that matters in one minute every day. Hello, I'm Colin and here are today's headlines from Pink 60. Free trial of Bradley Manning has heard that he suffered gender identity issues and had a female persona called Brianna. Serving before the repeal of DADT, he was victimised and assaulted for being gay. A Malaysian medical student who went missing three years ago has been found after photographs of his gay wedding circulated on the web. Arif, Alfian Rosli's family are now trying to reconnect with their son who lives in Ireland with his husband. Texas Governor Rick Perry was put on the spot by a 14-year-old student over Don't Ask, Don't Tell. Rebecca Green said, I just want to know why you're so opposed to gays serving openly in the military. Perry said he believed DADT worked as a policy. Plans to hold a gay pride festival in Denmark to celebrate the life of Hans Christian Andersen have divided the local community. Hopes to attract gay tourism to the area have met with stiff opposition on the island of Funa. And finally, a video made by the US Air Force Academy's football team has been banned by the military. Titled USAF, I'm Sexy and I Know It, the film has been removed from YouTube. If you know where it can be found, please let us know. That's all from us today. Join us again tomorrow.